welcome guys to this game called Rise of Dragonian Era. Well, it's me, Zakaiga here, just bringing you this game. And I found this game because I used to, I used to play on M, M games. Uh, I used to play on those types of games. And like, there's this other game I was going to show you guys later on. It's called Seons of Fate. I, used, I play that game a lot, but I'm going to be showing you this game right here. Rise of Dragonian uh, Era. As we, I'm just making characters. It's my first time playing this, so I want to witness this with you guys. So I'm guessing there's a story to this. So, all right, guys, sit back, just relax, and can watch the trailer. Moves with your finger. Uh, hmm. So I'm guessing it's the water versus fire. Oh my gosh, this is so. That one does beautiful women. If you live in harmony with nature, the world will be filled with peace and prosperity. Only then can you attain true freedom. Azurian, the creator of water and earth, built a nest on the mountains in the far east to heal the wounds he endured from the war. There, Azurian used his magic to taint the world. Trees and flowers rose from the earth. The eastern continent was covered in green fields and rivers. Inhabitants of the eastern continents had little knowledge of the skills they needed to survive. There was a scarcity of natural resources, and because of this, conflict between the social classes was inevitable. In the end, they realized that the Dragon Lord of Azurian was the only one who could put an end to the chaos. But Azurian was still deep in sleep. In order to awaken him, the tribes had to set out on a quest to find a treasure which was hidden on the western continent. With their, With their unyielding, unyielding resolve, resolve and the blessed power of Azurian, his followers are unstoppable. They will cut through mountains and sail past oceans to obtain the treasure that will bring peace to their land and unite the continents. Rise of Dragonian Era. I like that. Alright. Hurry up and finish loading so we can get started with this video. Hmm. It's taking quite a while. Why is that? I can't really say, so let's just wait and see. Oh, it's finished. Alright, let's see. There's a there's two different types of units. Oh, I forgot. I'm in this clan with this union, so let's see. Oh, they don't have gender lock in this class. They're I know they're dead small. Oh, that's just a class. Hmm. I like this. Alright, so rogues, they use bows for long range and dual weapons for short range. No, no, they can't do this to me. Clarence. They can't do this to me. I love... Oh my gosh, my friend's gonna be so mad at me, but I'm gonna have to do it. So, I'm guessing I'm going to be a rogue today. 
Yeah, I'm gonna be a rogue. Let's go next. Hmm. Face shape. I like that. Meaning scary. Uh oh, mustache. Oh, scars. Yeah, that all sticks out to me that much. I'm gonna just go with the <laughs> eyebrows carved. Okay, let's go. No, you can't see the cut. Yeah, I like this hairstyle better. This skin tone. Um, a little dark hat. Um, I'm like, uh, no, I'm not that skin color. More of uh, that color. All right, hair color. Let's go with this. No, that, that color dress. Let's go. Next. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's just randomize. Yeah. I kinda wanna go back to the original. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna stick with the original. The original looks actually kinda good. Hmm. <laughs> oh, he had a big head. All I know, I want to be done. There we go. That's all I care for. Let's get to My foot is kind of big, so even though I'm kind of skinny, so yeah. Uh, it's just like that side there. There we go. Mm, let's go to next. Uh, my name. Of course, it's a Kaiba. I can't even spell my own name right. Oh, it's a dang shame. Alright. Takaika. You have now entered as a rogue. Hmm. Play the video. Kinda wanna play the video. But let's stop the uh let's stop this for now. I'm gonna bring up another video of the gameplay. So get ready. Get set. Bye.